How y'all doing? I was at the Great Outdoor Show in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania today. This guy was selling these, and I told him I was going to wanted to blow one up with the 454 Casul, which I'm probably going to do. He says these things are pretty good. I guess I'm going to try shooting it with 100 rounds of 9 millimeter. We'll see what's left of it, and then maybe I'll shoot something else out of it a little later today. It is cold out here, but when you shoot it, it's supposed to leave a supposed to react and change color. So, when I say 100 rounds, I already put one on it, make sure my uh, gun's on target, but I got that 9mm calico over there, and we're fully loaded, but one round, which is already into that target. Put me nice stock on it now. Let's see what happens here. I'm probably going to get tired of pulling the trigger. I'll be. That's a hundred. Took a while to get through all that. Go up here and take a look. Boy, my hands are cold. <laughs> Go check this thing out. I hated that firearm. That thing cost me so much money, so much grief. I tell you what, I love that thing now. This thing here, when you shoot it, it changes color, turns green, you can see there. Now, how many more rounds do you think I can shoot at this thing? Look at that. That's a hundred. I don't think I missed one time. As a matter of fact, I know I didn't. Still there, though. I don't think there'll be a problem if you shoot up top here too much. <laughs> Double action. <laughs> Look, it's still, still glowing green. Uh, they got different, uh, I guess if you live in Florida area, you'll probably want to get the one with a different temperature. You'll get the 80 to... 100 I'm assuming and then it got to 60 to 80. This is 45 to 80 because I It's cold here in Pennsylvania But a hundred rounds and it's still alive <laughs> Now I did put a pretty good hurting on it didn't I? All right uh, God bless look them up double action Reacting reactable target. I guess it's called all right God bless bye